Good morning, guys. Um, this is the final revision for DM208 uh, module uh, for the final exam. Um, I'm gonna give you some hints, some tips uh, about uh, what you need to be focused on, uh, where you should place your interest at the most. But obviously, you need to go through the whole the lecture slides. I promise you that nothing that is not in the lecture slides will not be concluded, included in the in the in the final exam paper. Um, please read all the slides, go through, okay, and pay attention in general uh, to the following uh, to the following topics of uh, of some lectures. Obviously. Uh, the exam is only two hours, uh, so uh, the exam paper will be consisted uh, from eight questions. Um, some of them are open questions, only a, a small minority it's uh, multiple choice questions. Uh, I think it's, it's only two multiple choice questions, so you need to be aware of the general uh, lectures slides uh, the syllabus that we delivered together uh, through Moodle should be consistent as your Bible so read it and go through uh, this video obviously you will see it and please uh, if you have any uh, questions this is not the time that I can answer any questions regarding the exam It's not the same as uh, we were doing on the lectures uh, so please uh, focus and uh, read all the slides. But despite of all the slides, please pay attention as is, as the uh, the whole module it's digital marketing. Obviously, uh, I will want you to go through uh, and explain to me what you have understand from digital marketing. Uh, I will want okay, to see if you understand what are the steps that needs to be taken in order to create a digital strategy. Okay, uh, a similar question, uh, of course, will be included. Okay, you can answer it um, via bullet point style or uh, you can uh, address it as an essay answer, uh, but the six, seven points, which is build your buyer personas, identify your goals and the digital marketing tools you will need, uh, evaluate your existing digital channels and assets, audit and plan your own media campaigns, audit and plan your earned media campaigns, Audit and plan your paid media campaigns. Okay, it's some steps that you need to take into consideration when creating a digital marketing strategy. Of course, you need to bring them all together. Okay, um, I will also want you to highlight the importance to know uh, which are the social media practices. Okay and which on um, 2020 social media are considered to be the best places uh, to invest your advertising money in order to generate consistent return on investment, such as Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, LinkedIn, Snapchat, and, and so on. Uh, referring to best practice services, as, I, as you will see from the slides, uh, it's, don't make it uh, all about you. Uh, watch your competition, choose the networks that work, change your platform content, keep in touch with your audience, and don't make content sales a proposal. Okay, uh, we'll already deliver this. Um, I will want you to explain me in a very short answer uh, the own and earned media frameworks in general helps us to do what? Okay. To categorize the digital vehicle assets or channels that you're already using. Okay, it's important to know that. 
uh, and what does digital technology include and what it, it allows? A simple answer might be, or a simple question, uh, that digital technologies include products and services such as computers and the internet, which allows the storage of data in digital formats. Okay, in general, um, the questions will be around that. Uh, of course, I will want you uh, to know about uh, the trends of digital marketing, the, the viral marketing, the social media marketing, and the mobile marketing. I will want you to, to know that. Uh, pay, pay attention and focus on some initials, PPC, CPC, SEO, CPM, uh, CTR, the click-through rate, the pay-per-click, uh, cost per cost, and the search engine optimization. All these uh, initials you need to you need to please uh, pay attention. It might it's possible to have a question like this. Um, also, a question might uh, might be in the exam. Uh, regarding to social media and then the benefits of the social media. So please be aware uh, either to tell me the benefits of the social media or either I will give you some benefits and some of them might be wrong. So please be aware to choose which one is wrong. Uh, as you understand, social media is a big part of digital marketing. Uh, and as well as affiliate marketing, okay, uh, I will also want you to, you know, to know and, and define and understand what is digital, what is affiliate marketing in general. Uh, it, it doesn't mean that because the, the midterm exam was placed and delivered uh, according to what we have delivered through Moodle and lecture slides from one to four, uh, lectures. It doesn't now means that the final exam will be will have included uh, questions that uh, were referred to the fourth lecture till the eighth. No, please don't make this mistake and revise only the last four lectures. You need to start from the beginning, lecture one, and you need to finish your revision at lecture eight. Uh, as I told you at the beginning of this uh, video, nothing that we didn't in, include in the lecture slides will be included on the, uh, on the, on the final exam. Uh, from my point of view, you should all score a hundred. It's only eight lectures, okay? Read it through, understand it, there are a lot of support materials as YouTube videos, as links to other websites. You have the syllabus in front of you in, in the Moodle and you know the books. Um, okay, maybe books, uh, it's something that is, is not comprehensive enough, of course, but it's something that you can add up to your general knowledge. But if you watch the videos that I've uploaded through YouTube that I, I personally selected, and the lecture slides, you will be okay. So, uh, the key points in the areas that I want you to focus is what I've told you, okay, in this video. And I do hope that you will be satisfied and make your revision. Uh, and uh, I wish to all of you uh, and one on one each of you, uh, good luck. See you next week in class.